and ask me what's up, man. Okay, you gonna come on here and just break me right, just right, like that, huh? This is Donald. Hey, 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 it's your boy Jay Hardcore, Hardcore Box News. What you got going on, bro? We out of here. Hey, 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 it's your boy Jay Hardcore, Hardcore Boxing News, back at you with what's happening in the world of boxing today. Man, oh man, I hope everybody's having a great day. And if you're somebody that's watching right now that has never subscribed, please subscribe right now. I was looking at my analytics and it says 97% of the people that be watching these YouTubes are not actually subscribers. So if that's you, please take that time right now and subscribe. I appreciate it. Moving on to what's happening in the world of boxing today. Man, man, oh man. Javante Tank Davis against Isaac Cruz. There has been a buzz about this. Yes, a buzz. People are talking about it. They said that the fight last weekend when Tank fought Ryan, or the weekend before last, Isaac Cruz was like a star while he was there. People was flocking to him. And everybody wanted to know, is he going to fight Javante Tank Davis again? So there is an interest of this fight as a rematch, for sure. And, you know, I like to see it as well because he did go 12 rounds with uh, Javante Tank Davis and uh, give it to Javante. He was hurt. His hand got hurt in that particular fight. And I heard it was some other stuff that went on during camp, but uh, that's not to be disclosed. But people are clamoring for this fight. And why not have this particular fight? Because you got May 20, if you got uh, Devin Haney against Loma. And the winner, uh, Shakur, is the mandatory for it. So if Shakur and whoever the winner is did get the fight, it probably wouldn't be until like fall or December. So while they waiting on that, hey, Javante and Pitbull Cruz, what do y'all think? Well, I talked to Calvin about that, and this is what he had to say about it. Check it out. And that you, would, you wouldn't mind getting that rematch with Isaac Cruz. Because Without a question, that's the only guy that I look at mm -hmm. that we made a star. You did. Well, you we made, made, made Roley a star, too. No, nah, Roley deserved that, to tell you the truth. <laughs> Roley deserved that. I see Roley, man, and I see Roley dead. When I see Roley, man, he a good guy, man. He just got he just got that mouth. Yeah, but that's what got him out there. That's what got him yeah. to fight. And that's why I say he deserved that. Mm -hmm. Okay. You understand what I'm saying? He deserved mm -hmm. it. Um, Pitbull Cruz, I want him because I understand that fight. Mm -hmm. You think this fight? That fight? Shit. That fight? Mm. Yeah. That fight. You know what they keep them quiet, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, as you can see, uh, Calvin Ford is definitely interested in that particular fight as well. He said, we made that guy a star, so he definitely wants that rematch, man. And, uh, you know, when I was sitting having that conversation with Calvin, it pretty much seems like that fight is already done. I mean, because he was talking about, you know, the heads to be, and he said to me, Jay, if you and I was about to fight, the way it would work is this. We would come present you the fight because the fight is already made on our side. We just got to bring it to you and say, hey, this is what we got for you, what you're trying to do. So by him saying that to me, that made me think one thing, that this fight is already getting put in the makings. And know why it makes a good fight? Because it's an American fighter against a Mexican fighter and a Mexican fighter that actually went the distance against Javante Tank Davis. And uh, some people felt though that he should have got the nod, you know? So uh, why not run it back, you know, to just to, you know, get, things, get all the talking stopped one way or the other. It reminds me of when Floyd Mayweather fought uh, Marcos Madonna. You know what I mean? And everybody was like, yo, 
he was giving Floyd the business. Me too. That fight had me on the edge of my seat. And I was like, whoa. I was like, man, this dude was giving Floyd the business. So, And I was there. So they ran it back. And it was just like how I thought it should be. It was like the levels were totally different. But one thing that I learned in that first fight, Floyd said he wanted to fight this guy toe to toe. He wanted to fight him his way to make it an exciting fight. And so that's what he did. Floyd stayed in the kitchen the whole time, going toe to toe with him, slipping punches and everything. And uh, he outpointed the guy, uh, hands down. But I take my hat off to Marcus Modana because uh, he really rumbled. He can't, and the engine that was on Marcos Madonna, man, it was amazing. That guy, the way he started the fight is the way he ended the fight. So uh, I was like, wow. I was saying, man, he did his thing. So, uh, you know, it's just like, you know, this fight. You know, it's no different. People want to see, was it a flu? They want to make sure that uh, 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 Pitbull Cruz uh, is the real deal or not. And uh, I definitely want to find out myself. Well, I already know who's going to win this fight. Let me get, get a stake on that because there's levels to this. And Tank is on definitely a different level. But would I like to see the fight? Yeah, because I like rumbles. I, I love rumbles. So uh, that's definitely something that I'm totally interested. It seems like, as Calvin say, the heads to be uh, interested in that fight. So don't be surprised if you get this fight next. And I know it's got some people out there, oh, man, he should be fighting Devin Haney. He should be fighting Shakur. Those fights are not happening this year. Get over it. It ain't happening this year. Them fights got to marinate. Them guys got to up their level. Them guys got to do a pay-per-view fight for the, mo for the money that they're going to want for these fights. They going to have to show their worth. That's just boxing business. So you're just going to have to get over it. Fill my, uh, my, my uh, inbox with a whole bunch of comments. It's okay. I'm all right. I got tough skin. But that's just how it's going to have to be. That those two fights are not happening this year. Any of the other uh, fights probably will happen, but your core of Devin Haney against Javante Tank David, stick a fork in it. It ain't happening this year. It's your boy, Jay Hardcore, Hardcore Boxing News. I love all you. I'm out of here. Make sure that you subscribe. Make sure that you share. And like I said, if you one of the people, man, that come on here and shoplift the show, come on, man, don't do that. Just hit the uh, like button. It's free. Hit the share button. It's free. And subscribe. It costs you nothing. I'm out of here.